Hey everybody, getting the walk in, beautiful and quiet. A little bit of noise in the background. All right, so um, I was really thinking today on Shabbat about um, repent for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. I woke up to that and then I was led into that to go through the Bible to several different um, points. Um, Matthew 24, Luke 17, um, Hebrews something, I forget which part. Um, back to Revelations, back to Matthew, back to Luke, back to Mark. I mean, I was, you know, jumping all over the place, just sitting with all of that. And, you know, that saying, um, those who have ears to hear, let them hear. Those who have ears to hear, let them hear. And again, the third time, let those who have ears to hear, let them hear. And again, you know, there's all these pointing and, and, and you know, directionals to pay attention, you know, and either we are going to pay attention or we're going to ignore what the Bible says. And, you know, as in the days of Noah, you know, a lot of times people get on that kick and they think, okay, well, okay, the Noah time, there was a flood and there was, you know, um, negativity going on and certain groups of people, etc. And they could take one that one slant. And then another direction could be that, um, as in the days of Noah, people were eating, they were drinking, they were having marriages and celebrations and partying. It was like, everything was just like any other day. Um, and so in Revelation, when it says, you know, as in the days of Noah, it's like, you know, when the flood came, everybody was busy just living life and it was like they were taken by surprise. But let's be realistic, okay? Noah took, it took Noah, it took Noah a hundred years, 100 years to build that ark. So, you know, he pretty much for a hundred years was saying, repent for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. And everybody thought that he was nuts. And he was nuts to build a, a boat. He was nuts to talk about what he was talking about. And the bottom line is, there was a hundred years of him saying the same thing over and over again, and everybody ignored him. Now, I look at myself and I think, okay, I'm, you know, approximately halfway through my life and meaning that I've already gone through a portion and I know what I know I know what I don't know and I know and and then I don't know what I don't know okay and and God's in control that's for sure what I know and I'm looking at these verses and I'm going wait a minute wait a minute as in the days of Noah and you know these people were quote swept off, swept off their feet, like completely by surprise. They had no idea that 